Good morning. It's a Monday, June 25th. Our top story today is an upcoming major revamp in Darden's uh, Red Lobster menus. Uh, Darden, of course, is the largest uh, buyer of seafood in the world for food service, and decisions that they make on their menus can have a significant impact in the seafood market. Uh, what Darden is saying, although they've not released the details, is that they are definitely going to increase the value pricing uh, items in their menu. Uh, they've struggled re lately with some of their higher-end promotions. For example, a company executive said that their uh, winter lobster fest uh, promotion uh, was not as successful as they'd hoped, uh, and they attributed partly part of that to the spike in gas prices. But they also said that they priced their shrimp fest promotion uh, a dollar too high and that their own research had suggested that customers could absorb uh, this dollar price increase, but it uh, proved not to be the case. So Shrimp Fest was disappointing for them as well. In the latest quarter, uh, Red Lobster reported a, a poor uh, sales and performance record. So what does all this mean for the seafood industry? It means that Darden is apparently going to take a significant turn towards value pricing on many of their menu items. Uh, in interviews, company executives said they don't want Red Lobster to get stereotyped into a particular price basket. And as the largest uh, casual dining uh, 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 restaurant company, uh, the danger is that they're going to be seen as priced too high. So what does this mean for the industry? Well, I think that it's going to mean an increased emphasis on value-priced items and seafood and less attention or less uh, buying by Darden of some of the higher-end signature items. Uh, if Darden follows through, this could have some major uh, impacts in the overall seafood market because uh, so far we've been seeing this year the, the support for many of the higher-priced items, but that's beginning to weaken. If uh, this trend that Darden is talking about becomes a more generalized food service trend, the customer base for some of the higher-end seafood items is going to shrink and this will inevitably have consequences uh, in the coming year. In Nantucket, Mass., this is John Sackton.